Hey guys, this is Steven with the uh, Brave and Adventures. I know it's been a really long time since I've uploaded any videos, but I'm gonna start um, posting a lot more frequently. I'm kind of winding down with my time here in Israel and getting super excited because I'm gonna be back on the road. I am stoked. Um, I'm gonna be traveling for around six months or so, hopefully longer, depending how a few things go. I'm trying to switch from working in different locations to work remotely, primarily from my laptop, 100%. Um, that's the goal, and if I can achieve it, then you know I'll continue to travel um, without having to stop these long, long, long layovers in different countries for um, a period of time to to boost my savings and all that, all that responsible junk. Anyway, um, so today, um, can, I, can I give you? A, a lay down of what's been going on. I've been here in Israel for about eight months now, and I'll be here for another five, and then I'm going to um, be going to go to Hawaii for a couple weeks, a week or so, and then I'll be in, I think I'm gonna be in uh, the Philippines, and then Taiwan. I might swing over to Okinawa, Japan, back at um, my old, old place I used to live at. Um, or just, yeah, I lived in Okinawa for a couple of years. Um, and then I'll be going up to mainland Japan, and that's going to be awesome. I'll be hanging out with my siblings, um, be doing some traveling, hopefully going to go on some little little hikes. And uh, next year, I'm just stoked because I'm doing a bunch of bunch of cool hikes, a bunch of cool backpacking trips. Um, I'm going to be reviewing a lot of cities. Um, while I'm here in Israel, though, I still need to make some videos about a couple of places here, and so I'm gonna make a video on, let's see, Jerusalem. I already made one on Tel Aviv, I believe. Um, I think I took some footage for uh, the old city of Acre, which is north of Tel Aviv. Super cool place. I don't think I posted anything on, on there yet. And a lot of people uh, kind of miss that out when they come to Israel, which is like, you gotta check it out. Super cool little city. Um, it's small, but it's like, I, don't know, I think it's really interesting. So hopefully I'll post a video on that. Uh, and Getty, the Sea of Galilee, uh, Jerusalem, Assad, um, doing some camping trips. Maybe check out some waterfalls. I mean, there's a waterfall in, in, in Getty. Um, sorry for the shake. Don't mean to do that shake. And then um, I'm gonna be reviewing some cool gear, some of the stuff I used last year on a bunch of my trips. This thing I had last year, I used a bunch of last year on my trips. Super sweet, I'll try to put a link below um, to where you can get it, you can get it on Amazon. But Sea to Summit Ultralight Day Bag, this thing's a lifesaver. This is super sweet, super compact. Maybe it takes up, I wanna say like five or six ounces, I'll try to look that up. Um, but it's great for if you're kind of a minimalist backpacker or traveler and you don't want to carry a bunch of gear, which I wouldn't recommend anyway. I try to carry everything on my day or on my carry on when I fly around. Um, this thing's great for when you go to hotels. I don't know, I'm talking too much about it. But I will do a review video on this product um, and how great it is and whatnot. I'll be reviewing that. This emergency baby sack, which is new to my arsenal of supplies for traveling. Super sweet, definitely recommend it. Um, and I'm gonna be making another video on this thing. This thing is sweet, it's a like, a, it's a Sea to Summit silk liner for, mostly for hostels and stuff, but I'm gonna be doing some tests and trying to combine this with this and um, see if I can have like an ultra minimalistic um, sleeping system. I'm gonna do some camping, I'll let you guys make fun of me or laugh while I try to survive in that, um, see how that goes. And then, yeah, I'm doing some camping trips, um, reviewing the gear I currently have and talking about minimalism. So, I don't know if you guys know, but I've been trying to cut down my gear and everything I own from having um, in North Carolina an entire truckload full of, full of just junk you don't need, like beds and couches and um, different supplies for whatever, um, different gear and stuff that I didn't really use, and it was kind of weighing me down, making it more difficult for me to move around, and just more expensive to transport and store and all that, um, to where I'm at today, which I've gone to having basically 
everything I own can fit in my backpack, um, except for a uh, motorbike I have in the States, and I'm kind of be lending that long term to a friend, uh, and like I have a box of some paperwork, you know, it's at my parents' house, but besides that, basically getting rid of everything or got rid of everything, and I'm still trying to cut down my supplies and get better better equipment and gear. If you guys have any recommendations on um, uh, like really good, you know, t-shirts, long sleeve shirts, pants, shoes, sandals, sorry, sorry about that shake again. Uh, anything you'd recommend for traveling or for if you're a fellow minimalist and you want to help me out and having less lightweight things that are um, just look better, last longer, uh, more functional um, yeah please put it in the comments if you guys have any recommendations on gear or stuff that I should review I will be reviewing my new gear that I've gotten which is a handful of things and a few things I might be getting in the future between uh, now and when I leave um, obviously this you know my new camping gear and just things to do in Israel um, yeah just put it in the comments if you have any questions or whatnot um, just let me know I really need ideas on stuff to make videos about because I want to make as much content as I can while I'm here um, and just get better at it. If you guys haven't already liked and subscribed, please do that. That'd be so awesome. I know I should have said that at the beginning of the video. I always forget. But um, if you want to watch my adventures throughout um, Northern, Eastern Europe, Europe and Asia and some islands, next year please please subscribe um subscribe sub, sub, i can't talk today i'm I, just brain farting um please subscribe that would be awesome subscribe there we go please subscribe that would be super awesome um and i'm trying to get to a thousand subscribers before i leave israel so if you guys have any recommendations or stuff i should do that'd be sweet um and I think that is about it. Uh, otherwise, peace out guys and uh, take care. Having like, when I was living in North Carolina, a truckload, like literal, a tr it's hard not to swear. Try not to swear on this channel. Recommendations,